Good morning folks. I just thought I'd bring you along on the water can trek where I have to walk up and feed the new little plants. And the temperature about now is 29 degrees, heading to 34. So I can do a few now. I did uh, most of them yesterday evening, but it's not going to rain now until I think during the night, if we're lucky. And this is the only way I can water these. They've got, they're the furthest away from any source of water. But I just thought I'd let you come with me <laughs> to see what I'm up to. I'm sure the neighbours think the poor old girl's mad as a hatter. And I have to say, I tend to agree with them. We're out in the heat now, the sun. I don't know if you can tell that from here. But these are the tracks that we have to do something with. But, uh, as you can see, I'm coming up to the area where the new plantings are. So, this is the furthest point away from the house. Oh, I did those five a few minutes ago and now I'll do these five. See, I don't see if you can see that. If you can not a little tiny tot. I'll actually take the cover off just to show you and then oops and then each get a little drink and the idea is not to spray them all is to get the water down to where the tube was planted to encourage them the roots to go down and look for water they each just need a little drink to keep them going and hopefully they'll keep going until they mature a bit. Once they get started, they grow quite quickly. And here's number two. Number three. Okay, that's those five done. So, back to the house. But I think I'm going to stop for some coffee and toast before I come out again. But that's the, the ten that were furthest away from the house. You can see all these. All these should have been planted at least a month ago. But because we were waiting for the trees to re be removed, etc, etc, I couldn't do them. So, yes, we come back home. Oops, down the slope. And this is an area where I've been, I don't know if you can actually see properly, but I've been slashing down the Dianella, which had been neglected. Again, hot work, but they'll all come back. And down we go. Now 
and uh, yesterday we planted three Grevillea, oops, sorry, Grevillea chow, uh, Gaudi Chowdies, which have lovely bottle brush flowers for the birds, but they're an excellent ground cover, fast growing, which should, oops, now turn around. which will cover this bank. This is where the tree stump was taken out. So they should be all right. Grab the trusty watering can and back through the arbor to the house and some coffee and toast.